Hi folks, Lee here and welcome back to the channel. So, we lof left off... Lof loft off? <laughs> we uh, left off... That's obviously dead. <laughs> we left off at this relatively kind of awkward part of the game. Uh, and to be honest, I generally think we've got the right idea for what I was doing the last time. Um, so, I'm just going to head back that way. Um because I don't really see any other way of really being able to get past this section, so we'll continue back the way we came during the last video, uh, if, I, if I can get back up. <laughs> um, are we all loaded with everything? Let's have a... I always like to reload everything just so that... Oh, that's one bullet, that's going to do us a whole lot of good. <laughs> Um, but I always like to reload everything anyway, just in case we come across oh, which we might do now. Uh, something just hit us there, and then one of these guys spawns. So yeah, I think generally we're on the right course, and it's just a case of, you know, try to be a bit more skillful and time our jumps. Oh, that's a bit grim. Right. Get this thing. And we need to get down there, so Oh, that was that was close. Right, so let's reload this crossbow. And then I need to try and jump over to this thing. Can I make it for here? No no I'm not gonna make it. Damn. Right, okay. Oh, don't want to do that. Waste ammo. Um, right, so... Is that another dead scientist? I think we came across him already. Um, so... Let's go this way. Go down here. Get our crossbow ready again. Jump me back up here. Again. Quite a lot of rotary grunts down there. And then there's one there as well. Oh, that was not nice. No, I don't like that, do we? <laughs> right, okay, so... No, we do not like that. Right, okay. So... Oh, that was bad timing. Right, okay. Right. So... Just keep hearing these creepy voices in the game. I still love the aesthetic of this place. I just... Um, I've actually been watching some videos of Black Mesa um, again, and... You know, it looks good in that game because apparently I've read that when they were doing this section of the game, they kind of knew it was beyond the ability of the hardware of the time, if you know what I mean. So, oh, don't do that again, come on. Right, but yeah, like they kind of knew it was beyond the hardware of the time, but, you know, obviously it was a part of the game, so they flung it together and... You know, I actually think it's still pretty neat. Like, I still think it's a pretty good looking part of the game. Um, everybody else is like, oh, it's shit, because, you know, obviously, you know, as I says, they don't feel like they've done a good job of it, but I still think it's pretty cool. Like, you know, as its own section of the game. I mean, the rest of the game's really cool. Um, you know, some of the kind of tram levels and that I thought were a little bit kind of dull, but, you know, apart from that, I mean... As I says, it's one of those games that really, like, it's got a really compelling sort of atmosphere to it, if you know what I mean, I feel. Um, so, but anyway, enough talk, let's try and... I'm never going to make this, am I? Right, okay. I think you need to jump in one of the things, actually, you know, the things that are floating around. I think you need to go in one of those. I, I don't know if you need to, I mean I've been trying my best to kind of avoid that but 
Um, it might be that that's the only way you, you can actually do it. Um, these guys are really annoying. Go away. Right. There we go, right. Okay, so... I think I'll still need to jump in these kind of... rocky lily pad things. Um, oh, I missed that one, didn't I? Ah, damn. Oh, okay. Let's kill these guys. Fun. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna get past this section of the game that way, but I think I'm probably a goner, but uh, try and survive anyway. Nah, right, okay. So yeah, I think I need to jump one of those kind of like manta ray things that's shooting the lasers. Man, the art style of this game is just whack, it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so you try and still sort out this mic. I'm still getting to grips with the mic, you know, <laughs> at this late date, uh, you know, where I've already made like a lot of videos, like I'm still getting used to like basic stuff. But it's a learning process, so I'm happy to admit that it will take time, you know. I'm just going to try and ignore those guys completely until I get where I'm going. Right. I need to jump in one of these things. So... I might need to jump to one more of these things, like... A kind of lower one. And then finally on to the manta ray thing. Or I could just go for it, couldn't I? Oh, oh there was one right there. Right, okay. So I missed that one. And here, uh, here we are, continuing our theme of spending a whole video trying to get past a single solitary part of the game. <laughs> you know, uh, what if I jump for one as the thing's going up? That might be an idea. Where is these things? Bloody hell, these things are a nuisance. Right. Don't like them at all. I can handle dangerous enemies, but annoying enemies are a whole other thing. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, I'm genuinely hopeless at this game. I'm, su I'm really, really surprised I've gotten this far. Um, you know, it's pretty rough at times. Ooh. Oh, almost. Right. So yeah, I'm going to just need to try and go for it while that thing's gone up, because I think that's probably the best solution. Rather than try to, like, hopscotch between those other things. So... Just find one. There's my phone continuing to go. Uh, right. There's forty guns again. Right. So. 
Why would you wander into the laser thing? See, that's that's the stage we've gotten to at this game is like, literally, you see a big laser thing and you're like, oh, let's wander into that. Like, under normal circumstances, like, that would be the worst idea imaginable, you know? Literally, rule number one of life is don't wander into big laser things, you know? But, yeah, that's basically this game. Uh... He's not attacking me. I knew this point in the game was coming up. This is basically like... Oh, he is. Is he not? Does he just not see me? Because I know there's a point in the game where, like, they don't attack you. Um, and that's why I'm really looking forward to playing Blue Shift and Opposing Force, because those games I literally know nothing about them, whereas this... See, because of these green things they've got here, that's kind of like what's like controlling them, if you know what I mean. Uh, I'm kind of getting into the lore of the game here, but yeah, pretty much. Uh, right, okay. No. Oh. That was a nice shot, I like that. Grab some more armour. Let's get reloaded. Right, so if I jump over here, and jump over to this one, is that more of that kind of healing water? Yeah, it will be. Uh, right, so where do we go and go? We'll jump over here and see what's going on over here. Oh shit, that's not good is it? Nah, no, that's not good. Right, <laughs> okay, let's go. I, j I actually don't remember how you deal with this one. Although I don't really remember how you deal with any of them. I mean, let's be honest. <sighs> I think I would just go for this one, just... So what is he going to do here? Is there anything I can do with those things? Uh, how many? How many grenades we've got, right? What about for the launcher? Seven? Right. Lagged a bit there. Oh, damn. Oh, this isn't good. Right, okay. There's a way that there's almost certainly a way of doing this that doesn't involve like shooting the shit out of it, but I, I don't know if I can be bothered finding it. <laughs> and I don't want to look it up in a walkthrough, do you know what I mean? Because that's just like cheating. You know, and I've kind of prided myself on the fact that I've not needed to do that during this playthrough, which I'm actually quite surprised about, because it's been ages since I've played this game. Well, that was easy enough. Right. So... Yeah, that was pretty easy. But, um, yeah, there you go. Right, so let's go through this way. Um, we still lost a lot of health. There is healing water back there, so I suppose the smart thing to do would be to kind of backtrack a little bit and get some of that. And then we can continue. So that's big green tentacle thing over there. Probably don't want to go that way. Nice healing water here. This is a weird place. Right. Um, so, 
Yeah, Magnum's probably the best thing to have equipped at the moment. This whole video is just going to be like interrupting noise in the background because I keep moving around and my phone keeps going and all of that stuff, but we'll deal with it. So. Right, so that's us got some of that. Right. It's probably something to do with those things you were meant to use, but we dealt with them anyway, so um I'm happy about that. Good good health. Uh well, that looks dubious. <laughs> um we're going to go that way, aren't we? Right. That's lovely. I'm really going to enjoy that. You know. This is going to be a fantastic experience. Uh. Damn. Right, okay. I mean, these guys couldn't kill me the last time, so... Maybe I'll get lucky. Okay, that was easier. Down, right. Right, so wondering another big laser thing, cause that's normal. Oh, yeah, this is very kind of Lovecraftian HR Giger esque. It's pretty cool, and yeah, this is the bit where these guys won't attack you. This is like the kind of factory section of the game. So if I leave these guys alone, they'll just kind of go on with a thing. Um, so. No, that's the way I came in it. Right, okay. So. Okay, which way do I go? I mean, if I messed with all of these guys at once, like, I'd probably die anyway, so... Probably just as well, this is the one section of the game where they won't attack you. Because there is a lot of them. Anyway, let's get in this thing. Whatever it may be. That just goes up here. Right, okay. That might be a, like a healing thing as well, because it doesn't seem to do anything. Or it could just be there, you know. Um, what about jumping in this thing? Oh, damn. Okay. Don't want to do that. So... Don't want to do that either. So, 
so oh so that that goes up another level as well right no it doesn't matter I'll jump this bit oh well. again at this late date still messing up and failing with PC controls uh, right so Oh, right, okay. That didn't go well. Right. Yeah, I think it's really like the platforming sections of this game that probably get me the most. Um, you know, just because obviously I'm less used to these sorts of controls. Um, but we'll head along this way and see where this takes us. Oh no, that's not working. Right, so... We'll jump to the other one and see where that takes us. If I can jump to that central section there and then kind of just work my way around, see how that see how that goes for us. Right, so let you make it quick though. Then crouch just so we're going a bit slow. Is that just going to drop us down? Alright, oh, okay. This seems safe. Are they back to attacking us again? Yeah. Yeah, they are. Right, okay. So... Well, that doesn't sound good. Okay. Can I brute force our way through that? Oh, damn. Okay. Damn. Okay. Right. Back up. Oh. Man, a lot of dead HEV guys lying around. It's probably not exactly a comfort. But anyway, right. Oh, this takes us back up. That's nice. Oh, that was quick. Right, so... Take that guy out. Man, these guys really like to get in your face, don't they? Oh, right, okay. Okay. 
just a case of being like really accurate. I did my volume accidentally. Turned down a little bit there. I think it did. Right. So. I think that's dealt with. Uh, I think that's us dealt with all of that. So, um, this has been going for a wee while now. So, let's deal with this guy. Oh, thrown off a little bit there. Right. So, damn. There's a lot of these things. Right. No, not out of the woods just yet. Right. Okay, so that seems like a good place to end the video. Um, so, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, leave a like. If you hated it, leave a dislike. Uh, if you'd like to see me play more of Half-Life, then please do subscribe. And any thoughts, you know, please comment below. Right, bye folks.